Hello and welcome to a poker smith with some numbers. I am a smith and today we are celebrating the one year anniversary of Paldea Evolved. We will celebrate that by opening the ETB of Paldea Evolved. As I am coming off the back of a another night shift, I am ready here with my coffee. So as always, remember to grab that coffee, stay awake, stay alive. Most importantly, please like and subscribe and let's get to it. So obviously this being a year old now, I'm not going to spend too much time looking at what's inside the boxes. Uh, you probably already know. I'll do a quick little little run through and obviously as always I will add the time stamps, chapters, whatever they're called. So if you want to just skip past the opening and straight to the packs you can do that no problem so let's keep that player's guide because i do want to have a a quick run through the player's guide just to remind us what is in fancy funky colors yeah just to remind us what kind of um cards you can pull there's spiders um yeah these are the texture of these quite cardboard-esque as opposed to the newer ones which are quite like um glossy i suppose there is your sleeves the three starters your promo card which is yeah that's nice pikachu and his buddies i like the look of that Yep, yeah, more funky coloured dice and counters. Yeah, and that's it really. There's your packs. Making a lot of racket. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Awesome, all there. And here's the player's guide. Let's have a little look just to remind us what kind of nice big pulls are in this set so yep like i said this has been out for a year this was the ooh, let me think the second set to be released yeah lots of uh, lots of cool cards the uh magic carp get this closer in for now yeah the magic carp was popular one we've got all the starters like for for coco um Quaxley, yeah, everyone loves Quaxley. The uh chilling Raichu, that's a that's a nice one. I wouldn't mind pulling. Uh see the widow, I've pulled that one, I remember that one. Yeah. Mm, super huge Tyranitar down there. Yeah, forgive me if I say the wrong things. I've got a habit of saying the wrong name and stuff and uh i think it's to do with working night shifts being a bit half asleep all the time but hey uh yeah not really any on those page those pages that are fancy really the i'm not a big fan of the full arts really don't really do it for me i like the the full art um terrors the shiny ones they're they're, they're quite cool there's a bit of a difference to them Yeah, Iono's in this in this set as well, so that's a, a sweet trainer card to pull. Very popular. Uh, yeah. Uh, Grusha, sorry, Claire. Grusha is another one. Uh, Chimpao, I've pulled two Chimpals. And there we go, we've got the gold cards, which again, I'm not super fond of, to be honest, the gold cards. Don't really do it for me. If I was to get one, Meowscarada or Super Odd. But hey, okay, so there we are. We are reminded of what is in here. So let's get into the packs. Here we are. Let's get into it. Start off with Meowscarada. So, did everybody enjoy ripping Paldera Evolved when it came out? And are you still ripping into it? Is there still is there still a chase card you're after? Here we go. Lift this 
up a little bit. Yeah, is there still anything you're chasing? Psychic energy. Let me know in the comments. Snova. Fletchling. Voltorb. Lavo. Okay. Buried giraffe. I always say it wrong. Speed ups. Pass the minion. Stable eye. Oh, we got a gold card. Quack. Quaxcaville. Let me get that right. Okay, so not the one I was I pointed out, but still gold card. And a Oracorio. Alright, so definitely first pack magic going on there. Not bad at all. There we go, and the save got a closer look. Very nice. I think that is a pretty clean card. Maybe a little ding on the bottom corner. Center in slightly left to right. Yeah, you can see it on the back there. All right, cool. Move on to second pack. Let's see how we can do here. Okay, so Voltorb. Yeah, I'm going to go through these packs um, just because it's a year anniversary. So let's go through and see them all rather than uh, skipping to the uh, the big pause at the end. Orthworm and a Tinglu EX. So two out of two so far. Not bad. The ETB seems to be doing, doing good. Mind you, I've said that now, so we probably won't pull anything until the last pack. So has anybody had a look into Shrouded Fable yet? The next set to come out? Um... I'm not sure if I'm too keen on it, but I'd like to get your uh, opinions on it. Choice belt, super rod, a reverse spirit tome, and a weevil. There we go, just on cue. As I was saying, we were doing well. We get a pack with no pulls. Noibats, Paldean Whooper, Hoppip, Combi, Miss Magus, Bramblegast, a Superior Energy Retrieval, a Surviper, Reverse Combi, and a Hollow Wigglytuff. I mean, it's a cool little Wigglytuff. Alright, so. We go on. See if we can get another pull. Two and four at the moment. Yeah, I wonder how it's going to be like going back to these older sets because uh, Twilight Masquerade and Temporal Forces have been brutal and I think the, the study shows that they're about on par with each other. I think golds have been made a little bit more difficult in Twilight Masquerade as opposed to Temporal Forces. Yep, nothing again, Gyarados. Yeah, but um, yeah, the pull rates for the earlier sets, I think, were much, much better. So I was thinking on the anniversary of each set release to go back and do an ETB of each one, but then you realize that 
you can't get hold of Pokemon 151 anywhere. Especially in ETB. How much? So, that idea may not be going ahead. Unless there's a reprint. Don't know if there's a reprint going to happen or not. I'd be surprised if there wasn't because of how popular it was. Anyway, back to this. It's about time we got a pull. Come on. We've run three or four now without anything. So let's see what we can get. To the widow. Reverse. Aguaro. Reverse Tadbob. And a hollow Cerulege. Damn. Damn. I jinxed it, didn't I? Just like I said, after the first two, we won't get anything until the last pack. But we are going to manifest some penultimate pack magic. It worked in my last video. Let's see if it works here. Pineco, Merrill, Mankey, Delibird, Miss Magus again, Rumblegas again. Superior Energy Retrieval, Zolios, Luminous Energy, A, Kafaraja, EX. So, not the most exciting card, but it is a pull. With three out of eight. I mean, 50% pull rate. Not great. Not a great ETV so far. I have to check the value on that gold card. See how it's performing in the UK. For those of you that don't know or couldn't tell from my accent, I am from the UK. <laughs> Wilder, stay hydrated. Come on, last pack magic. Here we go. Tropius and Dunsbarth. Hopip. Cardian Wooper. Reversal Energy. Therapeutic Energy. Choice Belt. Reverse Murkrow. A reverse Florigato. Last card of the day is a Hollow Oregorio. Well, that's a shame. Okay, so I've had a quick look at the value of the uh, Quaquaval card. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Uh, it's around, retailing around £10. Uh, yeah, yeah, the big stores have it for around £10. You probably get it on eBay, a pound or two cheaper. But yeah, that's where we're at with this um, ETB. So unfortunately, not a very... Uh, not a very great ETB, but hey, it was about celebrating the one year anniversary of Haldir Evolve, and that's what we did, and I had fun doing it. So, yep, thanks again for watching. As always, please comment, like, and subscribe, and share to your friends, and I will see you soon. Bye.